Hello, dear everyone. Answering questions that we get on a regular basis about why people have certain issues and what do they do about the issues because at the end of the day, it's all about the solution and the best solution. So, hormone imbalances, what does that have to do with hair loss? A lot. Uh, number one, what are the causes of hair loss? Number one is low iron. Number two is low adrenals, which sit on top of your kidneys. And number three is low thyroid, and then comes low estrogen to a certain extent, okay? So, uh, iron. Vegetarians usually have that problem. Sometimes people, if their gut is inflamed, they don't absorb, they don't have enough hydrochloric acid in their stomach, they don't absorb their food, even if they're eating the best food, and their iron is low. Hair falls out, usually has patches in the uh, front that falls out. Adrenals. In today's world, everybody's so stressed out and anxiety-ridden that their hair falls out. It usually falls out, again, in patches. Uh, they can have a bald spot. Uh, they lose. They stop growing these little hairs at the, at the top of the hair because they're so stressed out. They're exhausted. They can't get up in the morning. They're exhausted in the afternoon, and their hair starts to fall. A blood type, A, B are the ones that have more problems than O. O's much more hardy, caveman sort of blood type. O usually loses their, rarely loses their hair, but can. So if your adrenals are low, and that's a hormone, that's DHEA, that's uh, adrenal hormones, and your hair falls out. Number three is thyroid. So if your thyroid's low, everything falls out, your hair gets dull. So thyroid really matters for hair loss. And then comes estrogen to a certain extent. Usually your thyroid and adrenals, you fix those first. And then you look at the other causes. It's rarely low estrogen, even in menopausal people. But that's why I have estriol support, etc. cetera. Plumps up the skin, makes the hair grow back uh, on occasion. So hormones are, hormone balance is imperative for healthy skin, healthy hair, healthy body, healthy brain. Hope that helps. That's why we talk about that a lot. Thank you very much.